They are the Shama Warriors LE. Here's why. Barefoot shoes are great, but barefoot sandals take it to another level. If you're a believer in barefoot and minimalist footwear, then these sandals are second only to being completely barefoot. I wear sandals whenever I have the chance, uh, which is pretty much all the time in Texas, <laughs> which is great. The Shama Warrior is zero drop. It is super flexible, barefoot. Check this out. Like, crazy. <laughs> as flexible barefoot as it gets. They're super thin. They're like five or six millimeters. And frankly, the most extremely barefoot footwear I own, which I think is fitting for sandals. Great for your feet. It will take a bit of time to adjust to these sandals, but it will also take a bit of time for them to adjust to you. Uh, straight out of the bag, they come in a bag. These sandals are very flat and mine were almost red. At first, I wasn't sure if they were gonna conform to my feet like the Cruisers have and like the Super Browns have. You know, as you can see, the Cruisers especially have super conformed to my feet. And finally, after like a week of wearing these, they began to really adjust to the shape of my foot and have a more natural feel on the ground. Um, and now, once they're broken in, the Warriors are easily wearable all day, every day. You know, you can almost forget that you're even wearing them. You know, they're super light, and that's something I love in a shoe. I know you hear it all the time, but just being able to forget about your footwear and live life is the bomb. They also uh, darken over time, which I like to, you know, as you can see, my footprint's kind of getting in there. And that's good because it gives them a little bit more of a neutral, natural style, which is nice for being able to dress up and dress down wearing these as needed. So I really like the leather look for that reason. But being leather, that raises the question, how does it hold up with running and hiking or with getting wet? They run pretty good. You know, I've run on pavement and on the gravel trail that I have access to and just on a normal trail type terrain. <laughs> They're great. Check out this tread. They've got this Vibram tread, which is better than any sandal <laughs> I've seen otherwise. I mean, check out the cruisers for comparison. This is the alternative, right? It could just be a very minimal outsole like that. They're great for more high, high intensity activities and I think they'll just hold up for longer. These are the most durable sandal that I own. They feel super tight on your feet, running and stuff. Shama does actually sell power straps, which is a $15 add-on that you can get that will add even additional security to your existing sandals if you want that uh, for an even tighter fit. But, but yeah, these are awesome for running, hiking, whatever you would wanna do in a sandal. Now, as far as getting wet, I actually did a test. I'm doing this for you. <laughs> I don't really want to do this. Nice and wet. You get to see how they perform wet. So, as you can see, they actually dried off pretty quick. Uh, it's been like five or ten minutes since I got them wet, so. So the performance doesn't suffer, you know. I didn't know if I would slip around a little bit or if they would feel less secure, but I didn't notice anything like that. They still felt great walking, running, whatever. I didn't slip around. They felt good. However, the footbed is goat skin leather, which is a durable leather. Um, so, you know, it'll be okay if it gets wet sometimes, but it is not made to get wet all the time. If you are planning on your sandals getting really wet frequently, I might recommend checking out the Standard Warriors, which have a footbed more like the Cruisers, which I think they call their Ultra Grip or whatever, versus 
the goat skin. The Shama Warrior LE is just over $100, and the Standard Warriors are just under $100. Um, if you wanted to try a more affordable alternative to start, you could try with the Cruisers, which are $60, if you just want to get a feel for it. But the whole point of this is that I have already done that and made that investment, so I can just tell you what the good stuff is. And this is it. If you were to only have one pair of sandals, period, I think you should get the Shama Sandals Warriors LE. Next month, I'll be showing you the third and final piece of footwear that you need for your minimal footwear collection, boots. But until then, check out this video where I tell you the only pair of everyday sneakers that you need, period. They are the best. <laughs>